I couldn't live without these containers. These are what comforters and pillowcases and sheets come in. They have these lovely zippers on the top of them. This one has a hanger on it. They're see-through and you can use them everywhere. Um, this one I keep like my flannel fabric in and scraps in. I keep um, velvet in some of them and just general uh, projects. If I have a project, a bigger project, I'll keep them in there. And then we use them also for... Yeah, so I, I have this thing about blankets. Um, we grew up in Kansas and it was cold and we live in Colorado and it's cold and <laughs> we're always afraid the heat's going to go out. So I keep my extra, when I get a comforter or a new bedspread, my extra blankets in these. And it's winter right now, so I have only one in here, but usually I keep two or three in this big one. It keeps them dust free, clean. You can just pull it out and use it. You can see what's in them, which blankets are in You can see which ones there. are in them, yeah. And then you can also label king size, queen, whatever you want. I have mostly the same size. Um, then I put my extra pillowcases in a sheet one because I don't always, I usually just wash my pillowcases and put them back on, but if I have company or something, then I can just look real quick and see which ones I need. They're already fresh and they're already clean. Then for this, now, <laughs> this has been well loved. You need to buy some new comforters I so you can have so. another bag. <laughs> Actually, I have another bag. I just haven't gotten to it. But this, I keep all year round and I keep extra gloves and extra hats. And I keep these Mylar blankets in here. I bought a package of 10 here on Amazon and it was like six bucks for 10 of them. People buy these and keep them in your car, mm, especially yes, if you live yes. in a cold climate. This is a no brainer. It's two bucks and it could save your life. But I keep this all year, all our extra hats and gloves all year in this little container. Then in the summer, I take it out and put it in the closet. But then in the winter, I can just grab it and throw it in the van. Then if like yesterday, I got broke stranded down. <laughs> and broke down, and it was literally two degrees. It was <laughs> freezing. I had this in my car and I didn't have to worry about that. If we broke down with five kids in the car, and even though I try to make sure they have hats and coats, it still gets really cold and you might need double or triple. So this is a great emergency prep, you know, type thing. Well, another but thing for if you go camping, yeah. to put things in, because then if it rains, they'll be waterproof for yeah, you. Yeah, and you don't have to worry about everything getting soaked. Yeah. So this is our, one of our favorite reuse items mm -hmm. is the plastic bags that all the sheets and comforters come in.